Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing another vlog type of video. I really, really liked doing the last one that I did. I don't know, I had a lot of fun just chatting with you guys and doing literally a bunch of random crap. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna be doing. I have to pack uh, because me and my family were going on a little weekend trip to Houston. We go a few times a year, but we only go for like the weekend. We'll be back by like, like Monday night so by like Tuesday morning we're here it takes us like 13 hours to get there so crazy I just wanted to kick it with y'all for a little bit say what's up how y'all been good I hope good you guys deserve to be good <laughs> right now I just got done filming a story time video so that's why I actually have my makeup done you guys know most of the time I come on here looking like the bottom of my foot <laughs> I went ahead and did my makeup and oh my god I finally got my eyebrows done yesterday they look so fucking good I went to a new like new salon because the one that I always go to they were away on vacation which good for them but like bad for me because that's my like go-to salon that I go to so uh we had to go somewhere else but they did a really good job on my eyebrows. I really, really, really liked them. And my little sister got her eyebrows done too, you guys. She got them done for the first time ever. Um, she just turned 13 like two weeks ago. She looked the same, but like slightly different. Like it's crazy like what your eyebrows can like do to your face. Like it's insane. But um, yeah, she got her eyebrows done. That was so cute. Oh, and I got my toes done. Just white toes. I really wanted to get like rhinestones on them, but the salon was like low key about to close. And I felt like bad being like, oh, you know, I had rhinestones too when I didn't even make an appointment. I just walked in and they, they were about to close. They were like 20 minutes from closing and they still were like, oh, it's okay. Like we can still do it. And so yeah, I just felt bad, but it's okay. White toes for the win. They look like little Tic Tacs. <laughs> Every time I look down, I'm just like, yep. Tick, tick. <laughs> I wanted to show you guys really quickly the air tags. Oh my god, what do you guys think about these things? Okay, these are the newest addition to the Apple lineup are these little air tags. Hold on, let me can I pop this out? Yeah. Ooh. So this is what the front looks like. It's just classic apple white the back has the little apple logo and it says like you know apple made it and all that stuff over the weekend i went to go get some because i just i don't know i just really i wanted some okay and it just made more sense to get the four pack if you guys haven't seen it each one of these is 29.99 for just one or you can get a four pack of them for 99 dollars, which is it just makes more sense that way unless you really only need one you know what i mean but i did want to show you guys kind of what they look like and stuff just in case you guys hadn't seen it anywhere yet or you guys were like trying to decide if you guys wanted one or you know whatever the fuck it is i still wanted to show you guys i have this one on my airpods because i lose this shit like it's no one's business okay i just leave this bitch everywhere like i don't i don't understand why i do that but this is what the little box looks like. As you guys can see, we got the four pack. This is what comes inside, you guys. It's literally, not much comes in here. Just some like little papers and like little instructions and stuff. No Apple stickers. They were like, nah, bitch, yeah, yeah I don't get no stickers. This is what it looks like basically. So you will, you'll open it and it'll have, you know, your four air tags if you get the one with four obviously i only have this one left in here because i wanted to show you guys how to like activate it and all that stuff i did one yesterday because i i couldn't wait but i wanted to wait to do oops i wanted to wait to do this one so i could show you guys how easy it is to like set these up and do everything i also got a four pack of these little holders for the air tags on amazon uh for like 10 bucks i don't know they were just black silicone ones they have different ones but i just went with some basic ones um apple has some too but the ones for apple you guys already know are like 30 dollars for the one and i got four for 10. <laughs> you don't need 
the little holders um if you're gonna like okay i'm sorry about that uh this shit died on me <laughs> but anyways like i was saying you don't need to get these little holders if you're just gonna stick it somewhere like for example this one i wanted to put it in my wallet just because i just feel like this is an important thing for me to never lose and um i'm not gonna use the clip because like where am i gonna clip it to like down here like that wouldn't that just kind of be annoying i don't want this to break you know what i mean so i think i'm just gonna go ahead and stick it somewhere in my wallet they're pretty thin okay they are not super thick um but they're they're thin um i don't know how like if you have like a flat wallet like guys i don't know how you would do that like i don't think you could stick this in your wallet because it would just fall out unless you have like a zipper or like something like you know in your wallet um mine doesn't open up all the way you guys see what i mean it just opens up like this and i do have like a little zipper compartment in here so i think that's where i'm gonna stick mine in um but yeah you don't need the little holders it's just if you want to attach it to something your purse your book bag type of shit like i said i attached my first one to my airpods because i lose those things more than i have lost my mind okay also i'm sorry for the guy that's cutting the grass um it just rained so i don't know how that's like happening anyways not my problem <laughs> what you do to set these up is you take off the little white plastic okay and you are left with the you know air tag or whatnot here's a brand new one so you guys can see before i like stick all my fingers all my fingerprints on it i don't know if you guys can see this but it has this little like paper thing right here okay yeah it has this little paper thing right here so what you do is grab your phone and you take this out and listen okay that means that it's on this thing will pop up on your phone and you just go ahead and set it up and you can choose a name it has like different options so like backpack camera bike headphones jacket keys um luggage stuff like that wallet but i'm gonna hit um custom name hit continue and you can actually choose an emoji the first one that i put on my airpods i chose the purple heart Ooh, which one should I do? I just picked the rose. Continue. And then it'll ask you, I don't want to show you guys because it has like my information on it, but it'll just ask you if you want to connect it to like your Apple ID and your phone number. You hit continue. Setting up. There's a little noise and you're done. That's literally it. That's easy as fuck, you guys. Like, let's say like, Oh no, I have lost my wallet. Where did my money go? Like, I, you know what I mean? I left it somewhere. You go into the find my app on your phone. And on the bottom, you get like a few different options. You get, you know, people, devices, items, and me. You hit on items and it'll pop up the air tags that you have. So um, I'm not going to show you guys because it has my address on there. And I'd really prefer for nobody to know where the fuck I live. But I'll show you guys. So you just click on the air tag that is missing. So for like example, like, oh no, my wallet. And it'll pop up like play sound or nearby if you, you know, you know you lost it, but you know you're like near it somewhere. So we'll play the sound for you. That's what it does. And that way you can find it. I believe you can set it on like lost mode so like if you've lost it and it'll actually th these things you guys are so fucking cool because they actually connect with like other apple devices so let's say like i don't know you left your airpods at the park right and somebody finds them it'll like pop up on their phone and it'll say like who it belongs to and like your phone number and you can like write a message like if you reported it stolen you could be like 
I lost my AirPods, please return, da 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 And like, you could do it that way. I was also watching a video because I was thinking like, oh my god, you could literally track someone with these, you know what I mean? Like, I could put it, I don't know, in somebody's car and like follow them, but it'll notify you. Like, if the AirTag notices that like, it's not with its owner and the owner is like following it, or like tracking it or something it'll start beeping like it'll connect to like your phone and it'll start beeping and let you know that you are being followed i saw this lady on tiktok she bought the four of them with like little bracelets and put one on her kids so when like they go out she doesn't lose them which is it's a smart idea i'm not gonna freaking frown and chat that's a smart idea as for like scratch resistant and stuff like that it's gonna get some wear and tear on it because especially if you have it like on your keys or whatnot i mean hello they're metal it's gonna be clinging and you know you just store your keys and all that bullshit so it is going to have some wear and tear to it this one looks pretty much perfect because like i said i just opened this one yesterday and that one that i showed you guys i waited to open it with you guys and to activate it with you guys because i just i like doing things with y'all <laughs> do you need them you know what I mean? Like it depends on like what you're sticking it on. I haven't had the chance to use it because I feel like my brain knows that I have the AirTag now. So now I'm like more cautious about them. But most part, I never know where my AirPods are. I always lose them. And you guys know like if like you just lose one of these, like you can find it with the find my app. You know, you can make it play a little noise to find one. But if you lose like this thing, like just the case with like the AirPods in it, that you're fucked you better start looking for the goddamn case because it's not gonna make a fucking noise you can have them customized on like the apple website to put like little emojis on the actual air tags i just went in and bought them because i mean i don't i don't have to have no because no customization on them i actually did customize my airpods though they say my name although you can't really tell because like the case is like clear but it has like little flowers and stuff. They do have some so that you can stick to like your phone or to like the remote. They have like these things without like this hook thing. You guys know what I'm talking about? So like the back of a remote or like, I don't know, like a drone or something like that. So that's pretty fucking cool. You don't charge them, okay? But they do have a little battery in them that has to be replaced, I believe, like every year or so so you guys let me know down below are you guys getting some do you guys have some and if you already have them or you are planning on getting them let me know what you're gonna stick them on okay like i said i did airpods in my wallet let me know what you're gonna stick them on are you gonna stick them on your airpods your wallet your computer your remote your boyfriend like <laughs> so i'm gonna go ahead and edit my story time that i just filmed and i'll see you guys a little later. I'm so annoying. Hi guys. So, um, the last time you guys saw me, I was showing you guys the air tags. Yeah, um, it's a few days later. <laughs> I don't know why I like always start a vlog and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm gonna vlog all day today and then I don't. I like forget, I, I don't know, I just, I feel like my life isn't really that interesting, so when I like go to vlog, I'm like, what the fuck am I gonna vlog? Like, <laughs> there's nothing entertaining. I'm about to pack because I have the weekend trip. We're going to Houston. Um, this is the bag that I'm gonna bring. I got it for free <laughs> at Victoria's Secret. Um, I forget when. I love this thing. Okay, it's so fucking sparkly, but before I do that, I wanted to order some breakfast. Have you guys ate yet? If you haven't, make sure you do so, okay? You gotta eat. I think I'm just gonna order some Dunkin'. What is you guys' like go-to coffee order? I'm gonna get an iced latte, medium, regular, dairy. Let's do whole milk. I'm gonna do caramel and hazelnut. And I always do no sugar just because I feel like the flavoring and like the milk like make up for it. Like, I don't know, I don't really feel like I need sugar in my coffee. What should I get to eat? A dozen donuts? Should we just sit here and eat a dozen donuts? <laughs> I'm gonna just do a sausage, egg and cheese. 
do I want it on a croissant or do I want it on sourdough bread? I'm gonna just do croissant. <laughs> so that's ordered. Now I'm gonna start packing. Um, basically all I'm gonna pack is like leggings and like, you know, shorts and like t-shirts type of shit because we're only going there for like two days three days three days and one of the days we're going to like a party so like i have like an outfit for that let me show you actually they're just these jeans they're ripped as fuck they're light wash um on the back it does have a little opening like a little cutout right under your butt so that's super cute i really really like these i got these at american eagle if you guys were wondering they are oh shit they're jegging oh even better super high rise jegging yes I love jeggings, okay? Say what you fucking want about them, but jeggings for the fucking win. I, I don't really fuck with jeans. They're kind of annoying. With this shirt, um, because I feel like this would be a cute fit, right? With some like brown or like nude heels. Cute, right? Okay. See, this is cute. Super cute. You guys can't even see the jeans. I had to like secure this on like the last little hole because it's a little a little loosey goosey but it's okay because cuando coma it'll hide my lojas <laughs> i hope i don't fucking like die in texas with the shirt because this is like a sweater like a sweater material type of shirt i don't my bra i won't be wearing this bra when i wear the shirt but um i hope it's not like too hot well it is gonna be too hot it's texas i think it'll be okay okay this is what i'm gonna wear sunday because Sunday we're just kicking it, probably going to like the mall or some shit. I'm just gonna bring some shorts, okay? All these things have the tags on them, you guys. Not because I buy like that much new clothes, but because I don't go anywhere. <laughs> so like, please don't be sitting and thinking like, oh my God, she like really goes shopping a lot, like no bitch. I just, when I go shopping, like sometimes I will find something that I like and I'll just never wear it because I never go anywhere. <laughs> so, Anyways, yeah, that's why most of my clothes have tags on. Anyways, but this is the shirt that I'm gonna wear. It's just a black little tank top type of thing. The neck line though is pretty cool. It's like a square cowl neck. I don't know. I don't know like the exact name of it, but um, yeah, this is so cute. So I'm just gonna bring this with some shorts to wear on Sunday. I got my breakfast. So happy. Oh my God literally the vein of my existence mm, so good i don't know what my life would be like without weed and caffeine <laughs> and here's my croissant mm, yes croissant I'm bringing some t-shirts with me because I live in t-shirts. <laughs> Obviously, this is literally what you guys see me in 24-7. I'm gonna just bring this Adidas one to like sleep in and then like it's hot as shit. I know that if it's hot here, it's gonna be even hotter and humider. Is that even a word? Humider? More humid there. I'm also bringing this one. This one's from Pink. It just has the on the back and then i'm gonna wear this for the drive with some shorts and then i'm gonna just bring these shorts to wear on the drive there and possibly on the drive back i'm also bringing this pair of leggings i don't know if should i just bring one pair or two i think i'm just gonna bring one do you guys see how many like outfits and like clothes I'm bringing? I'm taking like three different t-shirts, okay? Um, these leggings, the shorts, the Nike shirts that I just showed you and like... <laughs> I like overpack and we're just going for two days? Yeah, two days. Three days really, but... The last day doesn't count because we leave early, so...
for some shoes I'm gonna bring my little Adidas shoes because I know we're gonna be walking around and shit and I know I'm gonna wish I had these because I always wish I had these and I never bring them so I'm bringing them this time I have this stupid little hair it's like I don't know how it ended up this short like on the top of my head but it's so annoying I feel like a little troll how fucking weird <laughs> anywho you know what I was thinking that this tasted slightly different like it still tastes really good but just like slightly different from like the usual and it's because it's a veggie egg white instead of like the regular fried egg Which is still good. Still delicious. I have to go pack my makeup. Which, I hate bringing makeup with me when I go to Texas. Because I feel like it's just gonna melt off. There's like no point in me wearing any makeup. But... Because I know we're going to like a party and you know I want to stunt. <laughs> Although last time I brought my makeup and we went to like a little get together as one. I didn't wear any makeup. I was like, fuck that. <laughs> it's just going to melt off. It's more of just like if I'm feeling it and I want to, like I'm going to do it. I'm aware. If not, then now. Nah. Is good hopefully you guys won't fall <laughs> anyways i'm gonna pack some makeup i have this little makeup bag that i'm gonna bring along with this one i think i don't know i don't really know how much makeup i'm gonna bring i think i'm just gonna bring like the bare minimum to like do like a simple look you know what i mean we gotta start in order so first is primer so i'm gonna take my marshmallow primer and i'm gonna take this Wet and Wild Water Drop Primer. Coconut Water Drop Primer. I don't know. Take this one. Next is powder. I think you guys are actually on the powder. Oh no. You guys are on the blush. Have my Maybelline Fit Me. Elf Moonlight Highlighter. I love this thing so much. I use it pretty much every day. I'm going to just bring this Elf um, BB Cream bronzer i'm gonna take i think i'm gonna take my mark jacobs bronzer okay now for some blush which you guys are actually on so let's see what blush should i bring i'm gonna bring my dallas blush because i have fallen in love with that again and and this color pop one Hard to do with one hand but i'm bringing those two blushes because you guys know i like to mix and match my shit as for palettes i'm gonna bring this ColourPop palette it just has all these like neutral shades and they're really pretty you got some shimmer you got some mattes um you got lights and darks and stuff so very nice very good and they're pigmented as fuck okay so i'm gonna bring this and it's small that's the key. In my eyelash curler pencil liner. Um, where is this one from? Milani. I'm bringing the ultimate favorite, Sky High. And this NYX. I think this is actually supposed to be an eyelash primer. On the Rise Lash Booster. I think it's supposed to be like a primer type of thing, but I love this for my bottom lashes. And then I go on like the very, very tips of like the top lashes with it and it just makes it even better. But yeah, I'm gonna bring that. Let's see lip gloss and lipstick. I need to, I need to get some new lip glosses, you guys. I have three, three lip glosses. My lipstick, I'm just bringing these two lipsticks. This one's a Morphe one. It's like a lighter shade that I like to put on like the middle of all my lips. 
and this one i don't know where this one's from i'm blind as shit and i can't see the writing on it but it's this really pretty um just like nude type of color so i'll bring this one as well i almost forgot my eyebrow shit i almost forgot concealer can y'all believe that the elf camo concealer and this kylie cosmetics concealer i like to mix them this other concealer and this other concealer and this other concealer. <laughs> i'm just kidding but um i use those two for under my eyes and like forehead nose you know all the bullshit and then i use this uh benefit yeah benefit boing concealer to carve out my eyebrows I'm also gonna bring my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Freeze because I love this thing. But I think this in my eyebrow pencil, I'm gonna put in my like purse. I don't know how much of this I have left. Oh, yeah, see, I have a little bit left. Is that gonna be enough for two days? Or should I just go ahead and open the other one? I have a brand new one, okay? I hate, 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 hate being without eyebrow stuff so i have a brand new one here i think i just i think i'm gonna take the new one because i don't know if that one will last i'm sure it will last me the 30s but i'm not risking it okay i'm not going without my eyebrow stuff okay i honestly i could go anywhere anytime like barefaced but i always like to have my eyebrows like not done done but you know just like look nice because i don't know i just feel like your eyebrows do a lot okay oh shit this one's different <laughs> okay this time i have the nyx micro brow pencil this one's really really fucking good but if you guys are looking for a slightly cheaper option because i believe this is like ten dollars get the elf one literally the exact same thing oh actually i think the nyx one is a little bit bigger than the elf but they're the exact same thing the only reason i didn't get an elf one this time was because they didn't have the one that I wanted in my shade, but they had the next one in my shade, so I just got this one. I have my toothbrush and toothpaste and some little flossies and this little bag ready to go. I'm just gonna bring this first cream that I like always use and this other thing. I don't really know if this really works, but um, I have a little bit left, so I'm gonna keep using it. <laughs> Living Proof Scalp treatment thing i really really fuck with this i really really like it so i'm gonna shove it in there so i'm gonna bring my straightener if i even want to straighten my shit because it's just gonna get frizzy i'm gonna take this little coca-cola bag i'm gonna stick my brushes in here so let's see i'm gonna do a foundation brush a blush brush bronzer powder nose one some blendy brushes little detailed brush i'm bringing all these motherfucking brushes like i'm about to whip out my whole kit and like do my makeup almost forgot a setting spray i would have been mad as fuck if i got there and didn't have a setting spray <laughs> little concoction of powders in here you guys is some of the cody airs one powder that was in there halo glow setting powder and it's like a pink one i added some of that in there as well as this one this one is it, it just says hd powder but this one i felt like was too light like it wasn't setting well enough um and the airspun one i felt like was too heavy and then this pink one i just y'all know i be getting creative as fuck with my makeup okay i mix and match everything <laughs> I got a moisturizer and this serum. It's a primer serum, but fuck it. Okay, I think I have everything that I need. Oh, my deodorant. I did not have everything. <laughs> um, is that it? I have to bring tampons because bitches on her fucking period, which is annoying, but you know, whatever. I'm also gonna bring a few of these little Summer's Eve wipes. Okay, now that I have my whole house <laughs> packed. I think I'm done. We always go and get like shampoo and like conditioner and shit once we like get there because it's 
the first time we went you guys we like all of us brought our like conditioner and like shampoo and shit and i think my mom forgot hers there and she like left everything there and then um my little sisters exploded in her bag so <laughs> her like shit was all like soapy i don't know we just every single time we like bring shampoo and conditioner and stuff we always have like really bad experiences with it so we've just learned to like not and like buy it there so that's what we're gonna do but i think i'm done i need some jewelry the only time i would pretty much wear jewelry is on saturday but my shirt has the little like pearl thing so i don't really want to wear a necklace you know what i mean and um, i'm gonna just bring these earrings I'm gonna bring some chanclas, but I'm gonna be wearing those when I leave. So I'm gonna put them in here. So I'm gonna bring a blanket because I wanna be comfy. Um, so I'm gonna have that there. And I gotta bring my chargers, but I'm not gonna pack that until before we leave. <gasps> my contact stuff. My contact solution and a little contact case. I keep my contact case in my bag, like in my purse. Um, like so at night i can take them off because they start to hurt like at night like once my eyes start to like get dry and shit i need to get some new glasses honestly i had some but the lenses were like oh, they weren't they are super scratched and um i ended i broke them i don't know how i broke them but i broke them the little like correct me if i'm wrong but every single time i've broken a pair of glasses it has always been the little like leg part you know the one that goes like behind your ear the little stick it's always been like the right one or the left one it's always been there i've never broken my glasses anywhere else go ahead and charge my airpods because bitch a car ride without airpods not a good car ride okay and especially when it's a long car ride like the one we're gonna take today bitch okay you need some airpods okay i'm currently reading this nicholas sparks book it's called what is this shit called see me okay it's called see me by nicholas sparks and it's so fucking good i'm like on chapter five i think right now i just got it this week so i just started it but i love it okay i have it like on my phone downloaded so that i can like read it off of my phone because but i'm blind as shit okay so i can't read like books books I, I can but I have to be in like daylight or in like really good lighting and it just sometimes I want to read at night so the phone is perfect for that I really want to get a Kindle um but we'll see how long this reading thing lasts for me okay so I'm just gonna go enjoy my coffee my book and I'll check back in with you guys either later or in a few days hey you guys what's up <laughs> so it is a few days later okay i already went on my trip i'm back and i'm sick okay i'm not gonna lie like i don't i don't feel very good i think it's just the cold um on monday before we left we were out in the sun all day and i did not feel good like i don't i can't do sun okay i can't do heat i'm perfect in the winter where, it, where it's like cool but like i cannot do heat and then like on the car ride home the ac was like pointing towards me the whole time and i think it just made me sick uh, we got home yesterday morning which was like tuesday morning but um i just thought it was like the lack of sleep and that's why i like felt kind of crappy but now i know that it's, I, I think i'm just sick but i heard somewhere that it is really good to take a shot of tequila when you don't feel good for the cold so that's what i'm gonna do and also you guys um we're kind of not really celebrating but i just wanted to have a little little shot to celebrate one year of officially making videos on youtube which oh my god i know like that doesn't seem like a lot and it's like a whatever type of thing but shit's crazy you guys um <laughs> can't believe like i'm actually doing this this is funny but um yeah i wanted to take a shot i cut up some cucumber um slices to like eat with it because i don't have a chaser okay so i'm mexicana like i don't need a chaser and in this plate right here i just made like a little concoction of uh i don't i don't i don't want to like tip this over but it's just like tahin and chamoy 
with limon and sal and I'm just gonna like rim my cup with it and then we'll take a shot. I don't really drink anymore, you guys. I remember I could I could drink like a motherfucker when I was younger. <laughs> but um yeah, not no more. I'm using this really cute little <laughs> pink shot glass. I'm gonna put it here. And this is what I'm drinking on today, some casador, okay? It's like slightly less than a shot, but it's like, it's at the rim, okay? I'm honestly a little nervous for this because I, I don't drink, okay? Like not no more. <laughs> I feel like I drank so much before I turned 21 that once I turned 21, I was like, eh, been there, done that. <laughs> What's wrong? I'm like eating some of these, trying to prepare for this shot that i'm about to take i'm scared i feel like after the initial first like i don't know like three shots four shots maybe they just started tasting like water but like at the beginning <laughs> okay guys so cheers to one year together <laughs> and to many many more okay i'm really excited for my future I'm really excited about like my life right now and just like how everything's going 23 treated me good i'm not gonna lie i'm gonna turn 24 in october so in like a month or like two months um and i'm I, i'm just it's it's a good time okay 23 was good to me um the first year that was actually i think <laughs> good to me <laughs> so hopefully 24 is even better and it just goes up from there and of course you guys are coming with me so cheers okay how is it like pa arriba pa abajo para el centro y para adentro <laughs> oh yeah mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. hopefully that cures my cold because i hate being sick i hate feeling sick i guess it's the same thing huh I cut these really weird. But anywho. <laughs> so I think that's gonna be it for this vlog, you guys. I was editing like everything from before this earlier and it's already like 40 minutes long. So I don't know if I'm gonna like take some parts out and like cut it to make it like shorter. Or if I should upload like a long video. I haven't decided. That shot made my insides like <laughs> warm. <laughs> that wasn't as bad as I as I thought it was gonna be. I don't know why in my head I was like, oh my god, it's gonna be so disgusting. Maybe it's because it's casador. We also have some Malibu, but I didn't want to take a shot of Malibu. I feel like that's more for like drinks. Or maybe not. I think what you want. <laughs> that shot has me feeling right, okay? Like I'm not tipsy or anything. Like I, I have like a slight little buzz. I was thinking how to like, I go celebrate with you guys and I was like, oh, I have to take a shot with y'all. One shot for one year. Maybe next year I can do like two shots and like so forth and so forth. What if I do this for like a hundred years and I have to take a hundred shots? We'll see once I make it that far. <laughs> also ignore my appearance. I know I look rough, bitch. Okay, I look, <laughs> I look like I fell down the stairs. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, I don't feel very well, but I still wanted to finish this video and take a shot with y'all because it was officially a year on the 24th of this month, 24th of August. But this vlog isn't going up until a few days later, which is okay, right? If it's not, that's the way it is. Okay. Why did I ever stop drinking? 
Okay guys, so I'm done munching on my cucumber sticks and <laughs> you guys, I'm a little tipsy. <laughs> Bro, I think the last time I got tipsy off of like one shot was the first time I ever took a shot. What the fuck? Alcohol is very dangerous. It's such a different feeling to like when you're high. Like the feeling that you get when you smoke compared to like the feeling that you get when you like drink. They're like different feelings. I don't know, it's weird. But <laughs> I can't with myself. I'm like, I feel so like funny right now. I feel like a, like a jellyfish. You know the episode of SpongeBob where like all the jellyfish go to like live with SpongeBob and they have like a party and they're all just like, <laughs> <laughs> like dancing, that's that's what I feel like my body's doing. So I'm gonna go be tipsy and um, laugh at dumb things. <laughs> and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, whether this was a shorter video or the longest video I've posted yet, thank you so much for being here after one year, you guys. Oh my God, and I can't wait to have many more years with you guys and see what what happens don't forget to smile okay meditate drink your water <laughs> after we just had a shot <laughs> well yeah you have to hydrate you know what i mean um but yeah i'll see you guys very soon for a new video bye guys